Well, there are more than 65,000 waterfowl hunters in Wisconsin, and each year more and more women are giving this sport a shot. News 19's Danny Smith explains how Wisconsin wildlife organizations are making it easier for women to get involved. While the number of women in hunting continues to grow in Wisconsin and nationwide, hunting of all kinds is still a male-dominated sport. When I'm out there, I don't see a lot of females, and it's something that I'm really passionate about, and I wanted to help other women get into the sport. That's why, for the first time ever in Wisconsin, a Learn to Hunt Waterfowl event put on by women for women. Women are intimidated in a men's sport, and I feel if we can teach them in a woman's group, they would just be, have a better start. Wildlife officials say the top two reasons women aren't trying waterfowl hunting are a lack of means and a lack of knowledge on the subject. You know, with duck hunting, a lot of times you need decoys, you need a dog maybe, you need a vessel perhaps for the water. Like, it is just like so complicated. A lot of times, unless you know somebody or have a friend, how do you even start? So that's why these learned hunts are so cool, because it just is like this like platform for people to just jump onto. The Wisconsin Department of Natural Resources, Wisconsin Waterfowl Association, and the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service came together to make this happen. We worked on waterfowl ID, waterfowl regulations, um, different hunting gear and methods. Each hunter was partnered with a female instructor, and after learning the basics, we go out and we actually set up and and we'll. We'll try hunting, and then after that, if um, hopefully we have birds to clean, we'll show them how to clean the birds and stuff. Turns out, these first-time duck hunters got the chance to do just that. Jennifer Johnson, who traveled all the way from Indiana for this experience, took down her first bird, and says other ladies should give it a try. If anybody loves nature and loves the camaraderie of getting out in the outdoors, then you should definitely try hunting. <laughs> Even if you aren't in it for the kill, you get to watch the marsh wake up in the first thing in the morning. To me, it's truly amazing to get there dark and just watch the sunrise, watch the ducks start flying. Reporting in Tremplo, Danny Smith, News 19. And while they kept this year's group small to offer a more hands-on and personal experience, they hope to make this an annual event.